Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I look completely different. I don't know how to act. I love this hair. Whatever vibes this hair is giving me, I am living for it. Anywho, I am coming at you today with a new video. This one is exciting, I cannot wait. It's kind of like a haul combined with inspirations from Rihanna's Fenty clothing collection. Obviously I can't afford $800 on one dress. So instead I've put together some really nice pieces that I think you guys would enjoy because it's the cheaper version of Rihanna's collection. It's inspired, so they're not exactly the same, but it's inspired. So I really hope that I can help you guys out with this. Although I already know what I've ordered, I've not yet opened the bag, so I'm so excited to pop them open and share like my first impressions with you guys. I ordered Boohoo and Misguided. I got some pieces and then I have some pieces from other brands as well, like Lavish Alice. I really hope you guys enjoy this one. So let's get into it. Okay, I think we should start with Boohoo first. <laughs> I'm scared. <laughs> oh, okay. 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 I'm literally going in my bag and I'm picking out whatever first and then I'm just gonna try it on. So I know what this is. This is a blazer dress that I got. Quite thin material. Oh, I don't know how much these all cost. Do these things not come with, with the receipt? I swear they do. What? That's so strange. Do they not come with an invoice? Hold up, no, I didn't know it had yellow. I might like it, but wait. Okay, I'm just gonna draw it up on my phone. So the first one we have is a turn up sleeve blazer dress. I ordered this in a size 14 and it is 22 pounds, 40 pence. I think they were all on sale actually. Always go for the sale guys. Anyway, this was 22 pounds 40. So going with the Rihanna theme, I was looking for the boxy, quite big, baggy, but still sexy, a bit streamlined in some areas. And plus I was going specifically with the colors that she also has in her line. So she went for like the denim. She also went for nudes, pastel pinks, pastel blues, things like that. So I literally got clothes and items to suit that. So yeah, I'm gonna try this on. I'm gonna pair it with this bum bag that I also got from Boohoo. It was £9.60. With Rihanna's bum bag, she had ones that went with the suit, the same colors, block colors, but I wanted a contrast and I went for this snake print one. Quite nice. And it's black on the other side. It, it has that plastic leather feeling. It feels really nice. Oh, it's really nice. Spacious, love it. And it has um, an inside zip pocket as well. So I'm gonna pair it with that. I'm literally opening everything right now. I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> Rihanna has these beautiful mules that she's added to her collection. Remember, this is inspired, it's not exact. So, to go with this outfit, I've chosen, oh, they're so pretty. I'm size five. They were actually on sale as well, 25, and then I got them for 20. They have this pointed toe area that I'm in love with. I'm absolutely loving shoes that are pointed. I've always loved shoes that are pointed and now that they're back in fashion, I'm so excited. And they have three straps. I went with the whole snake print theme. They're not exactly the same and that's kind of broken my heart because I like it when things match properly. I like it when the colors go, but 
We're gonna try this on. Hopefully I love it, I think I will. Okay. This is gorgeous. The color is beautiful. I feel like the color really complements my skin tone. It looks really, really good. It's a nice nude for me. The material is thin and um, I wish there was a button here because it's so low cut. If the wind hits me, the dress will go. It doesn't cling to you like I thought it would. But like I said, we're going with the Fenty theme. So I think boxy is kind of what we're looking for. This is not doing it. I'm gonna quickly pop on the shoes and the bag and then I'm gonna try and pull an outfit together out of this. Okay, I'm back. <laughs> I think the bum bag, collectively, I don't feel like it goes with the outfit. I tried. <laughs> there was no bum bags that I thought would bring the look together, if that makes sense. I didn't find one and it really went with the shoes. But ever since I put the bum bag on, my dress has shrunk two more inches it's so i feel like it's so short i would i would still wear it out but you need to be precautious guys and the shoes i've never worn mules before in my life so i think i'm gonna have to get used to them they're stunning i love them they're so beautiful i feel like i can't really move no one is behind me but i feel like i can't move or I'm gonna flash someone. It's not even that short, but that's how I feel. Cause it, it doesn't hug the body. I feel like there's a lot of air going around. And see, me even doing that, I'm flashing boobies. Jeez, these shoes are so gorgeous. They're actually really comfortable. When I first put them on, they were kind of hurting my little baby toe. Cause I'm not used to wearing mules. I've never worn mules in my life. I'm a bit wobbly because I'm trying to find a balance. I'm used to things being wrapped around my ankle and I'm used to things having a bit more support. Right, so we're going to misguided. Let's go with this. This blazer dress, you can feel the difference already for an extra 20 pounds. This one is so much thicker and it has like inside lining and everything. This one is literally just the fabric. It was 40 pounds, size 14. So I'm gonna try this one on next. <laughs> I was really looking forward to putting this on. How, how is this a size 14? I had such high hopes for this. This does not fit me how I thought it would fit me. I just can't believe the, the sizing of this, it's crazy. The sleeves are a bit too long for me. Just a little bit too long. They have um, an inside button, like here, for extra security, which I can appreciate. This is very low cut, like the buttons start from here. So all of this is risky. AF and I'm a bigger chested person so I need to wear a bra <laughs> you just need double stick tape to stop it from moving and you, you should actually be fine this Rihanna haul is not going as planned I'm gonna try and pair it with some heels I genuinely don't think I have a belt that will look nice the belt the belt has done it some justice I'm using a five pound Primani belt okay so the belt has saved it a little bit. The belt has saved it and I've removed like my bra. My nipples are on the ground. And it, I feel so annoyed because if I really wanted to style this without a belt, I won't be able to because of the size. Maybe if I just get a size down, I'm gonna probably try it on with some heels and style it out. For 40 pounds, yeah. go next now yeah I do okay 
snow. We're not doing misguided right now. We're having a break. I have never, ever, ever, ever shopped at Aldo before until I came across these shoes. I am hoping, I am praying that these shoes actually do me justice because this dress is not it. These bad boys, oh my gosh, I'm looking at the color. This one is from Aldo, oh my gosh. I can't even do too much because of this dress. These are, I don't know if the cameras picked them up. These are slime, green, highlighter, tennis ball kind of shade, neon. Ooh, made in Brazil, interesting. They were 65 pounds, I think. They're beautiful. I just hope that they're comfortable. Mules is something that I'm gonna have to get used to because they're not the easiest things. To walk in if you've been wearing a certain pair of heels for so long they're not the easiest they feel so smooth like a fake suede kind of material and i got size five as always so going back to boohoo i didn't realize that i bought this white dress and the stitchings are neon green i didn't know that but they go with the shoes I'm really annoyed that they are neon green. I don't like it anymore. <laughs> but I've not put it on yet, so hopefully they'll look nice with the shoes. <laughs> I can't breathe. <laughs> this dress is opening. <laughs> I can't breathe. Okay, boohoo and misguided. You guys need to have a conversation because the last two size 14s I tried were very different. Boohoo, you like to put your size 14s near the 12s. You like to keep it low key. Misguided, you like to put your 14s towards the size 16s, big and bulky, yeah, okay. You need to come to a mutual because this is not acceptable. <laughs> I literally can't function i can't pull it down no i actually can't breathe <laughs> this is so tight around my butt because it was it was 28 pounds and it went down to 22 pounds on sale i'm thinking it's gonna be quite cheap material stretchy you know like how boo normally is with their denim it's kind of stretchy you know no this one feels like it was dipped in starch i feel stiff it's more on the, it's actually on the better quality spectrum in terms of material. So I give you props, Guhu, but your sizing is off. I just about fit in it, just about, barely. I'm exploding through the gaps. Anywho, for the sake of the video, I'm gonna struggle to breathe and try on the heels. I feel like mules make me look like an old woman but i see that they're trying to bring back i don't know what era it was but they're trying to bring it back from whatever time it came from i really like that companies are trying to put a millennial spin on something so traditional and i think it's absolutely gorgeous i love my meals i don't like the dress i feel like you can see everything i don't like the dress i think if the dress was in a bigger size, which I think I might just get um, a size up. Either I get a size up or I shed some pounds, which um, I don't really want to do. I can completely agree. It's the way I'm shaped. I am smallish waist, big behind. So the big behind bit is, is not fitting. I have loads of space up here. Down here, no, <laughs> not a lot, <laughs> not a lot of space. I'm liking the boxy feel. I am loving this denim dress if it just was my size. My shoes, I love my shoes. They're so comfortable. They are so gorgeous. Honestly, they're so flattering. I do like this outfit a lot. Okay, so we're gonna have to have a conversation. This is the material that I thought Boohoo would have provided with the dye white dress. 
This is size 12, misguided. Misguided size 12. This is what happens when you pay the extra. Your sizing misguided. I'm rooting for you because you make me feel a lot thinner than what I am. This is the closest to Rihanna I think we're getting today. I love this, I, I love this dress. Okay, so as I said, this is a collective haul. So I bought a dress from Michelle Keegan. So I bought a denim dress. This one is a navy blue denim. Just the traditional denim, I think. This is what I call traditional. This one was 45 pounds. <laughs> I feel like I'm going to school. This isn't really giving me a lot of sex appeal at all. I feel like I am a little kid. In this one. I don't mind it I love the quality I think I ordered size 16 because Michelle Keegan her quality is so good I thought that this denim would be like the boohoo one I thought it would be really tight but it's not this is not Rihanna ish <laughs> no I've opened up some of the buttons because that was too much there's still something about it that I'm gonna try and recreate this into an off-shoulder look okay so this is what i'm talking about if it was off shoulder like i wanted it it would look fire if i could actually rock this <laughs> like this i would so rock it like this off shoulder is the best obviously i can't see behind me so i don't know what it's doing it don't look bad at the back you know i actually <laughs> With me, if I'm not satisfied with something, I will make it my own. And this is something I'm making my own. I will actually wear it like this. This dress looks fire now. Well done. This dress looks fire. This one is from Lavish Alice. I've never bought from Lavish Alice before, ever. So I'm looking forward to what this has to offer. I got this in a size 12 and it was 58 pounds. I don't know why I got it in a size 12. And I got misguided shoes. They're also mules. So you know how Rihanna has the toe strap on her mules i needed to replicate that in some way some form and i got straight or rectangular heels which i've never had before and it has a strap on the top too this is what you call a dress i'm in love with this dress one problem <laughs> there's a lot of stuff going on back here so i feel like if i got a size 14 it would be fine other than that this dress is so beautiful this tiffany blue dress i'm happy i'm so happy i love the sleeves i love the trumpet sleeves they bring this blazer new depth and dimensions i have a new favorite i have a new wait it's a favorite but do you know how long it took me to get into this dress i don't know if you can see <laughs> But, you know, you probably can't see. The buttons are so small. So small. The buttons are literally nothing. And I have nails. It took me at least 15 minutes to do up every single button on this dress. But it's my favorite. <laughs> this dress is from Misguided. It's a shirt dress. It's 28 pounds and this is a size 12. I don't know where to tie it. Would it look nice like, or in a bow? The model wears it like this. It's a tiny bit see-through, but not really. Off shoulder and white, they go hand in hand. If this was like a turtleneck or something, my makeup will be all over the rim of this dress. The fact that you put it on this way and do it up, and it's off shoulder, it's in no contact with my face. There's not gonna be any transferring onto the rim of the dress, so I'm definitely keeping it. 
it's, it's so nice. Okay guys, this is the final dress. I really hope you enjoyed my haul today and I hope that I've given you a sense of relief that you do not always, if you can't, have to spend as much as an $800 dress. I will forever love Rihanna in terms of her makeup, her music, and now her clothing line and whatever else she has in the woodwork. But sis, I'm not at that level to be spending $800 on your beautiful garments. So I hope I've given you some alternatives. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys soon in another one. Bye.